everybody, I'm Lisa Roberry, your independent Scentsy consultant. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we are gonna be talking about the Happiness Blooms collection that is coming out this coming Monday, March 4th. This is such a special collection because this is actually a part of our participation in the Epcot um, International Flower and Garden Festival that's held at Walt Disney World. It's a mouthful, that's why I had to look down. <laughs> I was like, I know I'm gonna say this wrong if I don't read this off. Um, this is such a special partnership that we have had with Disney, and I love that it expands even beyond just Scentsy Buddies. Um, now it's a whole experience, and we have done this for a couple of years in a row now, and each year it's gotten better and better, I feel like, and this year, has gotten even better. So I'm really excited. We are gonna see some returning fragrances. We're also going to see some new fragrances. So I'm really excited about that. Um, I do have some experience with a couple of them so I can give you my opinion on them, um, but obviously I'm excited to smell some new ones as well. Now, this time around we were not given early access as consultants, we were not um, given the opportunity to purchase these a little bit early, and that is because we wouldn't be able to get our hands on these on these scents before the actual event happens. Like there's like there's rules and stuff with that. <laughs> so we are gonna be able to order as consultants along with you. Um, so we will be doing some first sniffs um, as soon as those bars do come in. But I'm gonna go ahead and read directly from Scentsy um, and then we'll kind of, I'll give you all the details of this collection as well as my thoughts on some of the fragrances that I am familiar with. So without further ado, for the third year in a row, we are thrilled to participate in the Epcot International Flower and Garden Festival that is at Walt Disney World Resort in Florida. Returning this spring, guests can enjoy the scents and sights of the season at Blossoms of Fragrance presented by Scentsy. To celebrate and commemorate Scentsy's participation in the 2024 festival, we're also offering three new fragrance flowers and six Scentsy bars, including three new fragrances inspired by flowers and gardens around the world. New this year, this is where things get a little bit interesting. New this year, we will be offering a limited number of exclusive garden bouquet fragrance flowers. I will have some pictures that will run at the end of this video so you can see what this, this new fragrance flower looks like. But there will be a limited number of exclusive garden bouquet fragrance flowers for festival guests to purchase. The goal is to introduce park guests to the Scentsy brand with a simple introductory, introductory product. So there is going to be a limited number of fragrance flowers that is going to be available at the park. This is so interesting. It's so different. Um, I know people feel one way or another about it. I'm not here to discuss that. Um, I just feel like it is a really cool opportunity to be able to introduce Scentsy as a brand and a product to people who may be not from they may not be familiar with Scentsy. So when they just see a name that is, you know, presented by Scentsy at the at the Disney parks, it's not going to mean anything to them. But something like this where this whole international flower and garden festival, it's a whole experience, right? So I feel like this is the perfect opportunity to, you know, have a limited number of of these products available for for people to to purchase and maybe get familiar with Scentsy and then when they try out the fragrance flowers they may wonder what what else Scentsy has in store what else Scentsy has to offer so I think it's something new and interesting and I, I don't see that there's anything wrong with um you know offering these things um for a limited quantity limited time um for people to purchase at the parks so um and obviously like people if people are wanting refills they're not gonna buy a ticket to disney world to go purchase a 20 dollars fragrance flower <laughs> like you know so um you know going forward if they're going to need like refills and things they will need to work with a consultant which which is good because I feel like the consultant is giving you your sensi experience as well so okay continuing on the garden bouquet fragrance flowers will come in three distinct designs reminiscent of the blossoms of fragrance experience at the festival so we will have heirloom rose which will have a pink fragrance oil we will have mint fields which will have a green fragrance oil and we will also have soft plumeria which will have a yellow fragrance oil Fragrance flowers will be available for purchase for $20 US that's in the park. So that $20 price point, that's just if you were to purchase in the park. 
um, during the 2024 Epcot International Flower and Garden Festival. They will be available to purchase through your consultant at $18, that's US pricing, um, through either, like I said, through your consultant directly or through your consultant's website. So that is the usual fragrance flower pricing now. So um, it is a little bit more expensive if you are going to purchase at the park, but um, through your consultant, it will be the, the typical pricing of 18 US dollars. In addition, we are offering six Happiness Blooms Collection Scentsy Bars featuring three new fragrances and three fragrances we're bringing back. All bars will be available for purchase individually, or you can purchase the 2024 Garden Bundle, which includes one bar of each of the three new fragrances. So if you are wanting that um, the Garden Bundle, it is only going to come with the three new fragrances, not all six. So if you want the 2024 Garden Bundle, that'll be $17, that's US pricing. And the new scents are going to be Garden Fresh Gardenia. The second new one is Glorious Grapefruit, excited for that one. And then the third new one is Hibiscus Sunset. So those are the three new ones that are coming out. I'm gonna read off the scent description for you here in just a moment. Um, and then returning Heirloom Rose. So for my, my rose lovers, the Heirloom Rose is coming back. We also have the Mint Fields Bar that is coming back, as well as the Soft Plumeria scent that is coming back as well. So let's get to the good stuff. What does what do these bars smell like? Now, clearly I don't know what the new release smells um, are going to smell like, but let me go ahead and read you off the descriptions. And then when my bars come in, we'll do some first sniffs together. So the first new one, Garden Fresh Gardenia, this is described as the intoxicating essence of gardenia petals wafts through fresh air in a garden of lush greens. I've got a few friends that I know are going to absolutely love that scent. Next one is Glorious Grapefruit. I think that's going to be a Rowberry favorite over here. <laughs> so Glorious Grapefruit is fresh squeezed pink grapefruit and juicy orange combined in this subtropical scent with a sprig of green leaves. That sounds so fresh and so citrusy. I think it's gonna be amazing. I'm really hoping that this is going to bring home what I have in my imagination of what it's going to smell like. Really hoping. All right, the third new one is Hibiscus Sunset, and this is described as take a sip of tangy pineapple juice sweetened with a splash of peach nectar and garnished with a showy tropical hibiscus. That sounds absolutely amazing as well. So I'm really, really hopeful for those new fragrances. Now, the returning fragrances, Heirloom Rose. Like I said, my rose lovers, bring it. Bring it, friends, because it's here. So Heirloom Rose is like a breath of fresh air. Garden Rose enlivens the senses with a sprig of lush greens. Y'all, if you like a good, and I, do, I say this with all the love in my heart, if you love a good powdery rose scent, this is for you. <laughs> it is very powdery, but it is such a tried and true rose scent. So if you love rose scents, Heirloom Rose is for you and will be available come March 4th. Okay, next one returning is Mint Fields. And this is one, this is described as wander an invigorating field of spearmint leaves and peppermint leaves with a light breeze of crisp greens. I have this one here from last year. I actually picked up a couple additional bars. I was like, I don't know that it's really club worthy. Oh man, it's definitely going into my club for sure. I, cause I warmed the few bars that I had and then now I'm down to the last one. <laughs> and I, I may have one more. So I've got, I've, I've got at least one or two that I've just been hanging on to because this is such a good one. And I am so picky when it comes to mint scents. Um, this is more of that, like almost a mojito. Like it's almost that, like uh, it's it's not toothpaste. It's not toothpaste mint. It's not peppermint. It is spearmint. It is that mint leaf. You have that green, that earthy element to it. That's just really nice and really refreshing. And when it's warming, it's really really nice. So. Uh, I love that. So I do have this from last year and it's so nice and totally not a typical Lisa scent, but I love this one. It's really, really good. So super happy they are bringing that one back. The last one that is making a return is Soft Plumeria, and this is described as Pink Plumeria evokes memories of island days with a slice of sweet apple and 
and warm white teak wood. I will say this one was a little bit on the powdery floral side as well, but if you like floral scents, I think you're really gonna enjoy that one. But I am excited to see these new fragrances that are being released. I'm super excited for these super fun, fancy fragrance flowers. Um, I love I love all the different designs and different colors that we're coming out with. It's just such a fun thing for the fragrance flowers. So this is all coming this coming Monday, March 4th. Now, what I will say is that per my news article here, um, this will be a middle of the night launch. So starting at 12.01 AM, that is Pacific time, March 4th, this will become available. So do I think that, that, that these are going to sell out? It's so hard to say. I. I would say probably at least not like right away. I wouldn't imagine that it's going to be a super fast sellout, but again, it's just, it's so hard to determine that. So if any of these products, whether it's the bars, whether it's the fragrance flowers, if any of this is tickling your fancy and you feel like you need to have these, um, definitely place your order sooner rather than later. As always, we are accepting pre-orders. So if you would like to be added to our order list, I will link the order form down below in the description. You do not have to be local to us in order for us to place the order for you. We literally just get onto our website, place the order for you um, as soon as these products launch and then it is shipped directly to your doorstep. So you don't have to get up in the middle of the night. You don't have to stress about a fast sellout or anything like that and we will take care of you. So. Again, the garden bundle with just the three new fragrances are going to be $17. That's US pricing. Um, then the rest of these bars are going to be $6 each. You might be wondering, well, that's not the licensed pricing. Thankfully, we are not actually calling these a licensed bar. So, so we do get the regular, the standard like Scentsy pricing on that. So we can also do a different um, bundle and save if you want. You can bundle three bars for $17 or the best possible deal is buy five, get the sixth for free. So if you wanna bundle all six, you should do it as a bundle. So you can get all six of them for $30. Again, that is US pricing. So there is that. So we've got the new Happiness Blooms collection partnering with Disney World Resorts. Absolutely fantastic. And I'm excited and intrigued with this new opportunity to have park goers have the chance to be able to experience Scentsy and maybe pick up a fragrance flower and experience it at home as well. So a little bit different, not something that's going to be a Scentsy norm, um, but just limited to this particular situation and experience. So again, if you'd like to be added to our order list, I will go ahead and link the order form down below in the description. If you have any questions, let me know. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like this type of content. If you're new, please subscribe. If you already subscribed, be sure to hit the notification bell. That way you stay up to date with all things Scentsy. Have an amazing day, you guys, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, friends.